Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and buy Jug now. Oh, this is good actually. So if I buy Jug, then I can save up for... I've got enough. Yeah, they all, they all... It looks like they all did the fruit plant, so it all works. So I did get the fruit plant, so we can buy Jug. I think it, it's I think it's a 50-50 chance though. So we got a fruit plant here. And if we go down here, we can go ahead and get another fruit plant again. If you take a look. There's another fruit plant. Did we get a fruit plant as well for this one? So now if I save up... Uh, if I get 2,500 points, this that's another fruit plant. So it's not a 50-50 chance. I'm going to do it in the same order I did it before. Because it seems like that's always giving me a fruit plant. But basically I can get um, Speed Cola. Double tap. Uh this round so if i get that this round then i can try and start going ahead and getting um plants from the fruit and i might not even have to build the kt4 overall we've got another max ammo and a carpenter which is going to be really helpful and a seed which is going to be really helpful all right let's just end this round um because we need 5000 points yeah if once we ah, there we go we can go and get double tap and um speed cola now and that means we've got all four of our perks which is <laughs> really good okay Maybe this challenge won't take as long as I um, actually thought it would. Because, hmm, don't want to kill the zombies though, because I really don't want to know if the fruit plants, like, die over time. Or, like, die before... Get out of here. Die before you kill them. So, let's leave these two zombies, and hopefully... It'll be Speed Cola up here, which it isn't. Great. So, Speed Cola should have dropped from the machine, which means we'll have to open a door. God's sake. That's fine. We can go and open that door, and then we can go and... Yeah, we can go and do some stuff. We can eat these plants, because if these plants are to give us a perk, like um, Deadshot Daiquiri, for example, or Electric Cherry, that's really good. Okay, so since this challenge is... Hmm, since we are potentially going to get a natural... May as well get the water. Where was I going again? I've completely forgotten where I was going. Okay, I was going to get double tap. Wait, I already opened this door? Oh, no, okay, graphical glitch. All right, speed color's here. That's where I was going, so I was getting speed color and double tap. Oh, my God, I nearly didn't have enough points there. Probably should have been a bit more careful with my points, because I really wasn't looking. So we can go ahead, and we can get... Oh, I don't want to... I want. To, I did green... F oh, yeah, let me just uh, throw a grenade at this. And there we go. Okay, now we have double tap. I'm going to go and eat the plants, and if I eat the plants and it gives me the actual ones that I need, that's really, that's really good. It basically means that this challenge is going to be over pretty quickly, and um, we've done well, and it it's kind of like fun to look at as well. I'll probably make this all into one video if it does do quick too quickly, but let's see what we get. So eat fruit. Oh my god, you hear that? All right, see, so look. That gave us nothing, but we just vomited. Okay. I'm pretty sure you get an achievement for that, but it might be because I'm playing offline that I don't get it. Eat this one. Okay, we vomited again. Okay, so maybe this challenge won't be as quick as I actually thought it would be. Because we just keep vomiting. Maybe you need a perk slot. Let me see. If I vomit again... Oh, so you need to get perk slots and then eat the fruit is what I think is what you have to do right now. That's what I'm starting to think you have to do. So, wow, that's a lot harder than I thought. Okay, because... There we go, we did just throw up. Oh, that makes sense. One too many. So, that's what the achievement's called. So, let I, Oh, God. Let me uh, just kill the zombie and run back around. So, let me think about this now. So, I've just kind of... Ah, oh, I think I get it. Because if it's 50-50, it wouldn't have just given us free non-existent... I think you need a perk slot. Then, once you eat a fruit plant, that means you can go ahead and um, actually get the perk. Right, so... We have quite a bit to do this round then, because we're not done. We're actually next round. Yeah, all right, let's go start the next round, because we have quite a bit to do now. So we need to save up some points. I understand. All right, so this challenge is not going to take as quick as I thought it would, because I was just sick from all of those fruit plants. And basically what that means is I think I'm pretty sure that I need to have a perk slot. Whoa, that zombie. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that means I need to have a perk slot in order to actually get a perk from the drop. Which is interesting. So this is going to take a while, and it does mean I have to build the KT4. And I'm starting to think as if it would be more beneficial for me to upgrade it into the Masamune. Oh, fucking Thrasher, man. Just go away! We have double tap now, but the Thrashers... Ah, oh, I don't like them. I just... I really dislike them. This map... 
it had a lot of potential. I really, really was excited for this map. I'm still, I still like it, but it, it's just not as good. And it's been out for a month tomorrow. It's just, it could have been better, honestly. It could have been a much better map. But I will deal with what we got. It is pretty, it's still pretty awesome, I can't lie. It's, but it, it had more potential. And it was kind of ruined, in my opinion. Okay, so. We need to end this round pretty Look how much ammo I just spent on the Thrasher. It's so annoying. Oh, there we go. We've got another seed and a double point. Is that enough? I just saw him. I just saw another Thrasher. Oh, I bet another one's going to spawn now because that spore's just gone. All right. I don't know how Thrashers spawn, to be honest. They're just so annoying. Oh, just like... Oh, my God. What what, what even just happened there? This is why I hate this map. Because you spend so much ammo, like, trying to kill the Thrasher, and then you just... Oh, that was actually pretty quick. Alright, we have a lot of points now, so... We can go and build the KT4 now, and I'm probably going to trade it for my VMP. So I can go and build the K... There's a lot to do this round, because I have to... Wow, there is a lot to do. Okay, no, I'm going to save this... Ah, oh, I messed up. Wow, okay, this is a lot harder than I thought, and it's going to take a lot longer than I thought. I get what I have to do now. Alright, so if I go down here... And I go and pick up the plant. I'm not going to upgrade it to the Masamune because that involves getting the skull. Getting, it just involves so much extra stuff. I'm not doing it. I refuse to do it. I'm just going to have to pray that the KT4 gives me what I need. So if I go and get this plant and then I get the KT4. So plant. Thank you. Uh, shoot that. Oh, that's one of my challenges. Yay. Maybe I can get the KT4 then, but I have to complete all the challenges. It's basically doing the Easter egg is getting the KT4. No, it literally is. Getting the KT4 is essentially doing the Easter egg, and I don't, I don't like that. Don't mix like gameplay. Oh, don't die, please. Yeah, but Treyarch, really don't. This is like a big thing for me. Try not mixing gameplay elements of the map with Easter eggs because that just ruins the map, in my opinion. Like for example, Dies and Jark. Yeah, if you get the bows, that's just getting the bows for playing the game. But in order to get the Masamune. Is basically doing the entire Easter egg. You know, if you know what I mean. Because essentially, if you don't get the Masamune, the Easter egg is just getting free cogs. That's it. So if you don't count all the things that you have to do, the Easter egg is just to get free cogs. That's literally the entire Easter egg. I'm not a fan of that. Oh, I forgot to build the KT4. I should go do that. So, in my opinion, I really don't feel... I really feel as if Treyarch should not mix easter eggs with gameplay features or like mixing gameplay features with easter eggs. The KT4 or the, and the Masamune should be its own separate thing instead of yeah okay no it should be involved to use the easter egg but the easter egg itself shouldn't be to create the KT4 and stuff because it's just no it's just not right. Essentially the easter egg is just oh and I just swapped it for the wrong gun Okay, that's fine. Yeah, but essentially what the Easter egg is, is basically building the KT4. And if you take that out of the, the equation, then the Easter egg is getting four cocks. Simple as. Simple as that. That That is the Easter egg. I'm happy to use, like, gameplay features. Like, say, if we had to upgrade the Masamune, then do more to the Easter egg. Like, have more to do with it. Like, say, oh yeah, we have to go and shoot the KT4 up there, shoot the KT4 up there, shoot the KT4 up there, in a specific order, just just to make it more interesting. Instead of just having, basically, the entire Easter egg being to create the KT4. I'm, I'm making sense to myself here, but I don't think I'm making sense to anyone else. But we're on round 10 right now, uh, and what we need to do is, we essentially need to go and doodle doo over here. Yep, doodle doo So if we go over here, we can go and get the blue water, and then we need to plant the blue water, and we need to shoot it with our KT4 to upgrade it. Oh, we can go and fight the spider boss, but might not be the best idea. Probably should hit the... Bo okay, there's a spider. Yeah, but we should probably hit the box soon as well, uh, just to make the spider boss a little bit easier. Say if we get the marshals or the KRM... What I'm going to do is I'm going to place a plant seed here, water it with the blue water, and then shoot it with the KT4. And then I'm going to go and... Do I have any more seeds? I do not. And I'm killing zombies, aren't I? If that ends the round, I am... I'm just done. Alright, now we need to get the purple water. Because when this round ends, we need to go and... Ooh, get out of the way. My sprint's broken again. 
No complaints. Uh, okay, we need to dodge these zombies. Easy peasy. If my sprint didn't work then, oh, it would have been game over for me. Yeah, my sprint's being a little bad again, which sucks, but I'm just going to have to deal with it, and it's okay. Uh, okay, so see, look at those green little grows. That means that I have actually um, like harvested it, or I've, yeah, I've harvested it with the KT4. So that means I can all get the upgraded plant. Hopefully I can get a perk ball from them, because I know you can get perk balls from the KT4 upgraded like that. So, haven't really got much else to do now other than, uh, and, oh no, I can't afford, well, I can't afford it. I don't, mm, I do, yeah, no, I need to go see what my top challenge is. Because if I go see what my top challenge is, that means that I can uh, get the extra perk slot from the top challenge. I mean, I can get the perk -holic. Use the plane trap to kill 30 zombies. Easy peasy. I'm going to go and open that area now anyway, because I want to hit the box, see what I can get. So I'm going to do that. Uh, yeah. Oh, dude, this is so expensive. 750. Do I even have enough? Uh, I don't even have enough for the box. Yes, I do. No, that should give me five. <laughs> oh, that should give me a hundred points. I don't have enough. Please be like a. All right, where's this zombie? I'm gonna have to shoot you with the KT4. You're not even gonna give me enough. Oh, he gave me a hundred. Thank God. Wait, that gives you a hundred points. That's pretty good actually. All right, the Pharaoh is actually a really good gun. Yep, I've said it. Basically, the reason I've said that is if you pack punch and get blast furnace on it, you're really agile and like. Oh, I have the Vespa. All right, I'm just gonna come back to the box every round and hit it because I I want to. Uh, so, I need to kill 30 zombies with the plane trap, which isn't too hard to do, especially on round, like, um, 11, for example. You could probably get that done within a round, so that's actually really, really good. So we can do that pretty quickly. And that will allow us to get our fifth perk slot, which we're going to use for stamina. I'm probably going to do that when I have enough, so I'm going to go and survive a round, uh, and go and plant those seeds, and shoot it with the KT4, of course. Uh, so that one, so I've got the blue the purple water so if I go yeah I need to go down this way you can't upgrade the fruit plant can you no I'm pretty sure you can't see I don't have the skull of Nan Sapway I would go for spider bait but I don't have the skull so I'm not really going to be bothering to go ahead and get the spider bait get that I should probably go and oh that spider is so weird okay so that means we can actually go ahead and get the fruit plant this round or next round even not get the fruit plant but unlock the um and then that we can test our theory to see if that is how it works. I don't really want to waste it. Yeah, no, I'm going to go for stamina up instead of... Yeah, I think that's a good idea. I really hope... I don't know if the fruit plants disappear or not. So, I'm not... If, I don't really want to... Whoa, look at that one. Yeah, I don't need to worry about these guys. I probably should have kept the VMP. All right, so let's get the blue water now because we need it. And then we can go ahead and... Did I... Oh, I don't even know if I did anymore. I really don't know. I don't think I did. I, I kind of just got carried away. I, I'm, I got carried away with talking, so I kind of like forgot what the hell I was talking about uh, or doing in the game. And then I just kind of did a random thing. So let's boop, shoot that. And then we need to go over here and then kill this guy. So I did that. All right, I did, I, you know what? I'm just going to go for it. Let's just wait for these zombies to come. Or the zombies? The spiders to come. And let's check if I did actually plant this one. Yes, I did. Okay. See, yeah, my mind just kind of, like, disappears and goes off. Let's shoot it with the KT4, because KT4. And that should give us a max ammo, and now we can go and plant these two. So that's the last one for this. And then we can go over here, and we can plant this with the blue water. So that's the last one we need to do with this water. There we go. Then we need to go and get the blue water back. And then we need to go and shoot that with the KT4. And, yeah, it's all good. So this is going to take a lot longer than I actually anticipated in the first place. Well, no, it's going to take about the right amount of time than I anticipated. Oh, god damn it. Oh, no, I have the KT4. Whoa. Well, cancel. Yeah, I, d I forgot you could do that. Yeah, using the when using the KT4, speed color is kind of, like, necessary. So that's why I put speed color on. Over stamina up first, so I could actually go and do that. Right, so, fill the bucket. I need to go ahead and get my um fifth perk ball. So I need to kill zombies with the plane trap. So I need to... Oh, god. There's a lot of zombies out here. You know what? Insta-kill should apply to the Thrasher. I think is, is, is what I have to say. Oh my god. I can't... 
Knife! Oh! Oh no! 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 Alright, I'm fine, I'm fine. I need to build the shield. That is something I need to do. Alright, ne- Oh yeah, I need to do this as well. Oh my god, so much stuff I need to do. Shoot it! Did I get it? I think I got it. I don't think I got it. Okay. Shoot that. I don't- I don't think I got it again. There we go. Oh! Mm. 